I keep reading from me. <laughs> oh dear. Hey guys, Francis here, and today I'll be talking about what I personally use to create my content, such as videos and pictures and graphic design. So, yeah. Um, let's get to it. Happy quarantine, guys. I'm wearing my mask just to keep safe. So, for the first tool, that is the heart of my production, that is the MacBook Pro 13 inch 2015. This one is an i7 3.1 GHz dual core. Originally this was 256, but I decided to save my money and then upgrade up to 1TB with the Samsung EVO SSD. I'll link that in the description below. I've got all the ports that I need to do all the work that I need to do, including that SD card slot. Yes, that SD card slot is very handy. Yes. HDMI, the USB, and then on the other side it's got the Magna MagSafe 2. Magnetic charger, right? Yeah, there. And then you've got the two Thunderbolt 2 port, and then you've got your USB 3.0 here, and then you've got your headphone jack. Yes, you have a headphone jack, and then you have your microphone. So that takes care of my MacBook Pro. So for the next tool, that's this guy the iPad Air. There we go, in frame with the Apple Pencil. If it's what I needed to do, drawing sketching notes and uh, yeah really with the Apple Pencil again I mean it is the original Apple Pencil but then again people will make fun of it still I don't know if you remember the meme if you wanted to charge this pencil yeah this is risky do not do this at home yeah so I don't charge it this way I charge it with this little guy which is the um, adapter that comes with the Apple Pencil about, but yeah, that's this iPad, and then yeah. So now I'm in the living room, as you can see. Um, so here I've got my laptop right here. So, uh, yeah. Then I've got this accessory, which I'll explain later. This is a Thunderbolt to a internet port. I'll explain. Then I've got my two peripherals, which is the mouse and the keyboard. So again, in front of me, I have the TV and then I've got the table. And then I'll put the camera and explain what's going on and how that's gonna work. To get started, I decided to have my laptop sat on a box or rectangular box that is smaller than the footprint of the laptop. So I'll start with the HDMI here on the right side of my laptop, plugging it in. Then I'll head over to the left side, plugging in the Thunderbolt adapter to internet and then the MagSafe charger all plugged in, ready to go. With that stuff out of the way, you can see that my laptop is now like a studio grade machine or maybe, maybe not. <laughs> but it does give me more room to edit my videos and photos with more precision. So here's the setup as of now, so I've got the peripherals here and then the laptop in sleep mode and Then you've got the screen of the laptop played up on here So as you can see my mouse is live and there, visible So yeah, this is pretty much my desktop I don't have anything on the desktop other than the shortcut to my internal hard drive If I was plugged into my external backup drive it will be seen here but at the moment it's upstairs in my room so i'm in the living room at the moment so the reason why i put my laptop on this is to ventilate the machine while it's um, processing all of the stuff that you do on the screen here so that will help it breathe and keep the internal component cool yeah i really need an external graphics card but there you go so you can see it makes a lot more sense to have this kind of display. So yeah, this is my workspace. This is very crazy, but yeah. This is how I edit my videos. And then it will be, yeah, that's pretty much how I do it. Uh, 
Oh yeah, you gotta make sure that you put this on the TV. There we go. I don't think where the remote is, but <laughs> so here I am back in my room. So you can see that it is the sunset. I might do a picture later. Who knows? Um, thank you for watching this video. Um, if you enjoyed the video, please press the like button and comment down below. Subscribe if you're new here and if you want to follow my Instagram, that will be in the description box below. And uh, see ya in the next one. Roll the outro.